Hey guys, it's Roscoe on Space Couch today. I'm going to be reviewing this. Mark Codder's The Secret of Abu El Yazdi. This is a follow-on from his previous trilogy that starred uh, Richard Burton and Algie Swinburne, the romantic poet. Um, it was all about time travel, where a guy from the year 2204 went back in time to 1840 and assassinated Queen Victoria, or allowed a chain of events to develop that meant Queen Victoria got assassinated in 1840 before she'd had any of kids. Um, obviously, as you can imagine, history then goes totally off course, and it all ends in the third book, uh, Expeditions of the Mountains of the Moon, where the remains of the British Empire is holed up in the last city in Africa that hasn't been conquered by the German army. Um, it's really interesting, but as always with time travel stories, it's very convoluted. This particular one, Abu al Yazdi, this is what happens after. Basically, in their attempts to prevent the assassination of Victoria, guess what happens? It leads to the assassination. Fascinating stuff. I love time travel movies. I love uh, movies, books. And I also love steampunk. This is an excellent um, merging of the two, and I thoroughly recommend it. This gets at least a 9 out of 10, the big thumbs up and the seal of approval, and I can't wait for the next one. I've been waiting for this for ages. My local Waterstones didn't have it in stock, so I had to get it when I was up in Sunderland. Anyway, The Secret of Abu el -Yazd, I thoroughly recommend it to you, and anything else that Mark Hodder has written. He is definitely one of my must-buy authors at the moment. Anyway, guys, that's it from me. I hope you enjoyed my brief review, and I'll speak to you later. Bye. Peace.